Okay, YouTube, I am back. This is the same day, June 28, 2013, that I did my last video showing, telling the two new L'Oreal eyeshadows that I got, as y'all can tell. And I got a link back to my previous video that I did, which is the show and tell of the L'Oreal eyeshadows that I got. This is one of them. I decided to go with the L'Oreal Infallible with a twist, which is a purple eyeshadow. This is the first time I have ever worn purple eyeshadow, and I think it looks pretty good on me. But then again, purple is a universal eyeshadow. This is the one, if you're new to eyeshadows, I suggest that you get the L'Oreal or any purple eyeshadow for this matter, but I just love L'Oreal Paris. If you're new to eyeshadows and you're a person of color, I suggest that you start off with purple or black because purple goes with any skin tone. It doesn't matter. You can be as bright as Rihanna or you can be as dark as Naomi Campbell. Purple goes good on black skin tone. It doesn't matter whether you're yellow bone, red bone, you're my skin color, which is like a shade or two brighter than Kelly Rowland in real life. Or you can be as dark as African. If you're extremely dark African, this would look gorgeous on your skin tone. Um, also, black is good on certain skin tones. If you're very dark, if you're like a, if you if you if you know L'Oreal Ash um, Foundation, if you're like an N9 or N10 or a C10 complexion, um, gold eyeshadow would look good on you too. Very dark skin tones, go for gold. Any skin tone, go for purple. So that is it, y'all. This is what the, um, with a twist infallible L'Oreal eyeshadow looks like on me. Let me give y'all a close-up. And if my eyeshadow game is not good as far as blending, I am still new. I am learning every day. I'm not as good as one of my favorite YouTubers, um, Fabulosity is me. Um, P.S. I am not wearing any eyeliner. These are my natural eyelashes. I did want to get some eyeliner, but my mother was rushing me. Not eyeliner, but because my lashes are, as y'all can tell, my eyeliner is extremely dark. I don't really need no eyeliner unless I'm going for, you know, a very dramatic smoky eye. But I wanted to get some mascara. I wanted to try a new mascara that I've been seeing on TV, but I didn't have time. My mother was rushing me. And I wanted to get the one that makes your lashes look clumpy. Not the clump crusher, but I wanted the one that, you know, it clumps your lashes together to give that va 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 voom look. I love that Hispanic va 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 voom look. I don't like the individual eyelashes. I like mine to be clumped together and out. So, look for an eyeshadow video soon. But this is it, y'all. This is just a show and tell of the L'Oreal eyeshadow, which I am loving. I got to get I got to get used to wearing makeup more often. But anyways, we'll talk about that later. Once again, y'all know what to do. Like the video if it's helpful to you. Um, share on all your social media sites. If you have any comments, you know, leave it in the description box. I will get back to it within a week. Yes, my internet's still down, so still going to the library, but I still answer all y'all questions, hopefully within a week's time frame. That is it, y'all. Love y'all, and I'll see y'all soon with more videos.